فعاش القلب إخلاصا وصرت تحومك الطير تحلق في ثقافات وتنهل من روب الخير Now, why is this the end of all these qualities? Many reasons, I give you one, simple one. We heard about how we should be walking, how we should be talking, the ibadah, how we should be abstaining from sin, how we should not bear false witness, and so many other things, how we should spend and so on. Now we are making dua that we can pass on the baton and the, the candle can now be passed on to the next generation. So, oh Allah, myself being a worshipper of the most merciful, bestow me with all these qualities and ensure that my offspring, those to come after me are blessed. Subhanallah. Blessed in what way? In the same way, we also want them to worship Allah. We also want them to have good character, good conduct. And from this we learn that those who lead by example are the most successful. You need to remember this. When you're a father and you're a role model in the home, then your children will follow that example by the will of Allah. You are trying, you made a dua to Allah. You may have sometimes a little bit of turbulence because of the outside environment. But trust me, if the relationship is powerful and good, then the chances of success are far greater by the help of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.